Some time ago, I was sipping on some coffee and having some ham and biscuits. When a motion caught my eye through the truck stop window, it was a little lost puppy, half starved and shaking from fear. Well, I just had to make friends with him. So I picked him up and put him in the cab. And buddy, he took to that truck like he was born there. Well, I named him Little Joe. And as I watched him sleep on the seat beside me, that's when I knew that little Joe would be with me for a long, long time. Well, a few months later, I was talking to my old friend Teddy Bear on the old CB and not paying much attention to my back door. And little Joe started barking up a storm. I looked up and I saw a smoky in the mirror. And I slowed my rig down just in time. But you know something? Teddy Bear heard little Joe barking and he said, Hey, Big Red, let me talk to your partner. And I said, you got it, good buddy. How's the old smoky situation, little Joe? And little Joe said, gruff. Oh, that just tore him up. And the next 200 miles just flew by. Because everybody on that CB wanted to talk to little Joe. Well, one night we were headed through Smokies in East Tennessee. And little Joe started acting real nervous. I heard the sounds of lightning on the old CB. And suddenly we were in the worst storm that I'd ever seen. All at once I saw headlights coming straight at my rig. Someone was blinded in the rain. So I swerved fast and just barely missed the camper flips. But the shoulder gave way and we crashed over the side of the mountain. And when I woke up my truck was on fire and I couldn't move. But somehow little Joe grabbed me by the collar and pulled me away from that burning rig. Well, I was in the hospital the next time I woke up, and the doctor was there to break the bad news. The accident had taken my sight. Oh, God, now I can't even drive. And that's when I realized how helpless Teddy Bear must have felt before the miracle happened that made him walk again. And then I thought, well, now, where, where, where's little Joe? No, no, ain't nobody saying about little Joe. Where's little Oh, I was so sad. Well, my brother asked me to come live with him. And when he opened the door to my new room, I heard an old CB just a blaring away. Well, I couldn't wait to grab that mic. And the first voice I heard was my old buddy Teddy Bear, ratchet jawing in the distance. So I broke for him and he came right back to me. Why, it was almost like old times again. Teddy Bear was a yakking away unloading all the latest news on me and getting louder and louder. But all of a sudden, the sound of an engine seemed to drown Teddy Bear out. 